waking up just to say your goodbyes. Fame composure, but I know you lie. I know you try so hard, so, so hard. So guys, before we get started, I'd just like to mention that you're actually going to have to stretch the resolution of your monitor and your game. So we're not just stretching your game files, but we're also stretching the monitor. If you don't, you're just going to have extra problems. To stretch your monitor, um, you're going to make sure you have the NVIDIA control panel. If you don't, just go download it. Then once you've opened it, go to change resolution. And here you can see all the preset stretch reses. But if you're like me and you want to make your own, just press customize. Then just click on create custom resolution. Choose the res you want. Me personally, I use 1600 by 1080. Because I've already got it done, I don't need to save it or anything. But once you're done, just make sure you save it and you've got it on. Once you've done that, you want to find where you have Fortnite installed on your PC. For me, it's in app data and local. And you want to click on Fortnite game, saved, config, Windows client, and then on here, game user settings. Before you open that, go into properties and make sure read only is turned off because you won't be able to edit while it's turned on. So just make sure that's off. Once you turned it off, you want to apply. Then you want to open it and just scroll down until you see where it says 1920x1080. For me, it already says 1600 by 1080 because I changed it. But for you guys, it's going to say 1920x1080. And you just want to change it to the res that you plan on using. So you need to change it to all of these. This one, this one, this one, and this one. Once you've done that, just make sure you save it. Click up on file, click save. And after you've saved it, go turn on read only back on. So that's how you get any res you want. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, hit the like and subscribe.